Greetings and salutations, YouTube land. We are back again with another unboxing video. Today I have for you another double shot. These are the two latest releases I've gotten in from Special Reserve Games. So if you don't know, Special Reserve is a limited print video game company. They do Switch. I think they've done some PS4 and PC releases. I focus on Switch. I've been trying to get a complete uh, run of them, but I've got a really bad feeling I forgot to order a release, so I'm going to have to look into that. They have a very active and awesome uh, Discord community that I really wish I could spend more time in. I just... I don't have a lot of free time, unfortunately. I don't get to check my phone very much. Maybe one day work will get staffed enough I can actually start taking some breaks. Alright. Are you ready? Let's get ready for the unboxing. Jump, thank you. So yeah, the really cool thing with these guys are the boxes that they do. I know that sounds weird. They do these absolutely gorgeous collector boxes. They're similar to like the old NES boxes. Unfortunately, a couple of mine have gotten damaged. Um, I don't know what happened. I think rain got in a window that I forgot was open and some of them got a little wet. But so far, I'm trying to keep them. Yeah, I kind of lost my train of thought there. Inside. Woof, 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 woof. The ever popular stickers of Sarge. Uh, packing slip. And the game. This is the Red Strings Club. A very shiny cool box. I don't know if the number is going to come through, but this is number. 2,075 of 3,000. Must have ordered this one very late. I actually hit number one on one box. But I think that was one of the ones that got damaged, so... Curse my luck. I'm trying to remember this game. Unfortunately, so many indie games are coming out for the Switch that... It is just impossible for me to keep track. Let's see. Side we have packing that I'm trying not to destroy. A limited edition art print from Antonio Gardolia Batres. Batres. Neat. This looks like some sort of like cyberpunkish type thing. Ooh. Some goodies in here. Looks like magnets or coasters. Very nice. One is the logo. One looks like a martini. I believe a vodka martini, maybe with a perno float. Bonus points if we can get that movie reference. The numbered game. The artwork. I think they usually do a reversible cover. Which I usually reverse because I'm that type of person. This is uh, published by Devolver. I think like almost everything they do is. been so long, I can't remember how to open a game. And yeah, I do open them. I never get around to playing most of my games, but I do open them. One day I'll be a millionaire. We go inside. Yep. The reversible art. If I can get this out. neat. 
Definitely does not look like a kid's game. And the very cool instruction booklet. Which I am always a fan of. I don't know about this game. I gotta be honest. I ordered it for the collection. It looks weird. Not bad weird, but weird. Yes, it is a cyberpunk game. Alright, trying to get this back together. I'm trying to remember what the next one is. I'm not sure if I have any more on order or if I'm all caught up. I really gotta pay better attention. And it is. Ooh. So the steel book. That's nice. Oh, I think this is Ape Out. Those are always neat. I know some people love these. I usually don't put them in them. I like to leave them in the normal case. It is Ape Out. I've heard some good things about this game, but. Let's see. More Sarge stickers? Getting quite the collection of these stickers around. Number 2,659 of 3,000. Once again, I think this was an open pre-order and I ordered it like on the last day. Really cool box, actually. Like I said, their boxes are beautiful. This one actually has depth to it. I don't think it's on the camera, but... It's really cool. They put so much work into these things, it's insane. They care a lot. Let's see what's inside of this baby. We have the game. I think the only goodie was the steelbook. Said. I've heard some good things about this game, so I'm going to have to try this one. Ooh. Cart's loose. That's not good. Good thing about cartridges. They don't get scratched. Neat picture. Really hoping you play as the ape. Wow. This is a beautiful instruction book. Shiny foil. Dang, they went all out on this baby. Table of contents. It's really nice. There we have my two latest releases. I'll put a link to the site and the Discord server down below. I do recommend you uh, join. They usually make sure they take care of their fans in the servers, so it's well worth your time. And like I said, it's usually really fun. I wish I could hang out in there more. It is what it is. Hey, if you enjoyed this, shoot me that thumbs up. Anything to say if you got these? If you know anything about these games, I don't. Any recommendations, shoot them to me down below. You know I love hearing from you guys. Ding that bell so you can be notified whenever my videos go live. Hit that subscribe button over here so you don't miss any videos. So always be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes.